Yo, what it do is the king three stacks to the max is grind time supernova shine get your bank up get your rank up So we back with another video and this time I'm gonna be sharing some Creativity kind of like a refresher course. So, you know, I mean There's more to the king than just shit talking so the king can actually do some things or whatever So I'm gonna do a refresher course cause people don't like to go in the videos and search for shit so and it's been a couple of new people added to the channel so this is gonna be very informal and educational and in showing some of the creativity of the king but anyway so what we have here this is a marvel select diorama stand that came with the hulk figure now, on Instagram, it's a lot of folks that like to shoot scenes and stuff. This is a nice piece of little diorama scenery. So, I mean, it's cool. So, I had two of them. I got to thinking, you know, how can I turn this into something more? So, what I did... I did this. I cut I cut it into a square so you know why you did that let's look at both of them so basically we just cut it out cut it out into a square then like magic so voila out of cutting this into a square Casting it, making replicas of it, and putting it all together to form a broken down road, sidewalk, piece of scenery, or whatever you want to call it. So, if you take a look, it is a exact duplicate of this one. So, by having this. And flipping it from side to side you create a nice little scenery so I mean if you guys are interested in casting you know so just making one piece duplicating another flipping it to the other side combining it putting it together to make a work of art so I mean let's let's test it out with a so I mean yeah that looks pretty good to me so next what we gonna come up on is Tamashi Nation um, crater blast effect whatever you want to call it so this right here is a genius little invention it's good for scenery you can look like your stuff is being blowed to smithereens or whatever so i mean let's take it apart so one day i got to looking at it all three pieces are exactly the same so if you take this piece drop it in some silicone mold and just cast it you can make replicas of these and I know y'all seen my Instagram photos and my YouTube videos that I be using these right here so I mean adds a nice touch to what we already got here so And I did a lot. I casted them in black. Painted them with gray. As it would look like blown up sidewalk, concrete, whatever you want to call it.
then we got some brown ones so if you got that dirt scenery you need something blown up you know i mean you just make all different kind of colors when you're able to reproduce these things on your own so i've been meaning to try this but it's been a while since i cast stuff and i've been too busy buying toys not chasing making stuff myself and trying to sell shit on my own and get me a little business started um when i first started out with the gi joe classified i had this little thing called iron ken studios where ken was gonna try to reproduce stuff and sell it to the customers so another thing crates cast these up they go good they go good in the background for scenery and these crates was made off of this crate i don't know if y'all remember the spider-man classics or whatever but this came with that dude tarantula he had like two of them so by taking this casting it making copies and just making more so yeah it's way more to the kid than just talking shit and I was on another YouTuber video and supposedly they was interviewing ex-employee then it was some hating ass motherfucker in the comment section talking about some everybody likes it except this one youtuber who tried to get views off it man nobody ain't got to get views off that shit man i'm over here doing my own thing shit gi joe provide enough content for me ex-employee just some side shit so you know don't get that shit twisted but moving right along we're going to go to something else these rocks you probably seen them in a couple of my video i always use them to hold up my background to keep it from flopping on everything so basically i just bought a mold out of a hobby store to post some resin in and create this rock so this shit is heavy you can hurt somebody with this you probably can bash somebody's skull with this shit but it is resin cast it paint it up then i took one and combined it like so by sewing the top off and making it level and gluing it to the top of each other that way you can you know kind of get that scenery going you know so i need to get back focus into getting this shit up and running up and right but right now concentrating on a cobra base so i just ordered some crucial pieces to it today so all i gotta say is yo y'all ain't gonna be ready for this one it's gonna be more magnificent than the hall of bats so you know but anyway this has been a refreshers course you know just showing some of these fuck boy haters that it's more to the channel than what the fuck they think but anyway um hope y'all enjoyed this i hope it was very informational to you guys and maybe one day you guys can start your own the only thing that's standing between you and the people who are out here doing this anybody can do it if you are lit if you are living and breathing person everybody is the same only thing is different about those guys is they are taking steps to do it while others are procrastinating so you know if y'all feel like y'all want to do something 
just go for it, try it out, see where it takes you. Nobody gets perfect in one day a month. Sometimes it takes years and years of practice to become great. You know, some people have a natural talent, then some people take a little bit longer than other, but anything that anybody on this earth breathing does can be achievable by the next person if they put some time some grind time in it and they can get there too baby but anyway i'm gonna cut this video short you guys leave a thumb up and a comment tell me what you think this is the king three stacks i'm gonna be out in peace